<laughs> Welcome to Brent's Anime Recommendation Corner, where I talk about anime that I just love. And today I'm going to talk about Kaiba. Um, Kaiba is an anime series by Misaki Yuasa. Um, as far as I know, um, his first TV anime series. And boy, is it weird. Um, it begins with a young man waking up to find a hole in his chest. And like he literally yeah. has a hole in his chest. Um, and he lives in a very bizarre world, uh, which he discovers as he uh, explores it. You can see it's very retro. It's very streamlined and stylized. Um, reminds me a bit of like the old uh, Cyborg 009, the old, even the early Astro Boy stuff. Um, but it is visually very weird. Um, everybody in this world has their entire, all their memories, everything that makes up them, sitting in a little cone in their head, which you can pop out and then plug into another body. Yeah, that just works. Um, which means if you go into a dark alley, someone can pop your little thing out, grab your body. Take it someone can else. pop your cone. Yeah. It, oh, it's my. Weird. Oh, my um, <laughs> but hey, yes. Man, my cone's been jacked. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> Give me your cone, nobody gets her. And so it's the story of this young man figuring out what's going on in this world, why he has a hole in his chest, why he has this weird symbol on his stomach, and what's going on. And obviously there's conspiracy theory, there's, a, there's, there's conspiracies going on, there's, there's much, a lot more going on. It's a 12 episode anime series. Um, it's remarkable, it is memorable. There you see someone popping it right in there. Um, there's a lot going on. Um, it, there are certainly some more grown-up scenes later on in it, be aware. Um, there's also some <coughs> stuff dealing with um, the effects of having disposable bodies, which can be a little bit grotesque at times. Um, and so it's weird because there are times that it really feels like this is, you know, a remade Astro Boy story or something, and it feels very um, childlike. And then other times when um, it gets pretty, pretty serious, um, it's a series that uh, hits a lot of range and is just kind of fascinating and definitely not for everybody. It, it's, a, it's a weird one, but if you like experimental films, uh, if you like oddball anime, but if you like things that are made to purpose, where their themes definitely do come together, Kaiba is one of those things. <laughs>